Specify elevations for custom waypoints to plan flights to and from them like you would airports. Complete with accurate climb and descent performance calculations and depictions in profile view. Both user waypoints and custom waypoints imported via content packs support elevations. To specify elevations for user waypoints, go to More, Custom Content, and tap User Waypoints on the left, then tap into the waypoint you want to edit. Tap the Elevation field to enter a number in Feet MSL, and tap the plus-minus button in the bottom left to toggle the value between positive and negative. Tap Close and then Save in the top right to update the waypoint with the new elevation. You can also specify elevations directly from the map by enabling the User Waypoints layer, tapping a user waypoint to view its details, and tapping Edit in the top right to add and save the new elevation. If you're not sure of a point's elevation, you can easily find it by tap holding anywhere on the map and looking at the location row at the top of the Add to Route window. Custom waypoints imported via content packs also support elevations. The list of waypoints must be contained in either a CSV or KML file placed within the content packs nav data folder. To specify elevations in a KML file, open the file using a plain text editor and scroll down until you reach the list of waypoints. Each waypoint's location is defined using the coordinates tag which includes the latitude and longitude, plus a third value for the elevation. Since this value often defaults to zero, ForeFlight will ignore it unless you replace it with a non-zero number, either positive or negative. Specify the desired elevation in meters, and ForeFlight will automatically convert it to feet after you import the content pack. To specify elevations in a CSV file, simply add a column named Elevation and insert values below. Plan more flexibly with your custom waypoints by specifying elevations for each and visualizing them in profile view just like you would with airports.